How's it going, boys? So today we're taking magic extremely serious. Oh yes, that means we're playing a zero IQ red deck. Oh, and it's magnificent. Ah, uh, I have a prediction. It's gonna be three minutes in, and I'm already gonna be begging for the sweet, sweet release of that. But until that point. Uh, four Fervent Champions, four Grim Initiates, four Scorch Spitters, four Thin Street Dodgers, four Cavalier of the, the Enchantment, uh, four Onyxes, three Chandra's Lolly Versions, four Chandra's Spit Roasts, four Light Up the Stage, two uh, Experimental Frenzies, and three Troll Bjorns. Oh yes, boys. It's, it's, it's exactly what you probably expected. 22 lands, 20, 62 cards out of 60 because it's a red deck and it does not matter one bit. So, let's just get a cracking and see what happens. Probably something, I don't know, it's, it's a red deck. Do, do you expect anything? I expect to win and not have fun while doing it. It's a great time. Everyone loves it, except me. But yeah, oh, one man... Perfect. Perfect! Could not ask for a better start, boys. Let's be real here. Okay, does enemy couldn't get to go first? That would be a little bit a lot disappointing. Look at that, a bunch of fun drops, a candle year, blah, 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 and a Chandra split roast. It's like this was intended. So I'm gonna start off with this, not the champion, because it be like, here's the deal. This, this, this is the extent of red deck skill of Magils. And it works like this. <clears throat> we drop this turn one because maybe if he has a one drop, we need to light up the stage. So, you know, stuff's happening, boys. Stuff's happening. Oh, yes. Definitely. So, let us hope for something amazing to happen. For example, uh, land. Pretty sure that's in our option list. Ah, perfection. Ah, as you can see, everything's in our option list. As long as we get one more land and a Chandra Spit Roast, boys, we're gonna have a good time. Oh, look at that, it's an innkeeper. No one cares, enemy con. Absolutely not a single soul in this universe cares that you have innkeepers. Well, actually, I do, but, you know, deadly schmedly. Okay, enemy con, good luck. Are you gonna block one of them? No, you're not. Good boy! That means Chandra Split Roast is gonna have a great jolly of a time. And if we're lucky, it's not gonna die, and then we can play the child. What the hell was that? Huh? Hello? What? Nani? Uh, was that? What the hell am I playing up against? Game? Well, I, I, I guess Magic figured out a way for, you know, uh, uh, the red decks to also lose, it seems like. He, well, that's definitely an option. Wow. Uh, yeah. Did not exactly expect to see that one. Uh, but th this is fine. We still have two spit roasts up and, you know, all we need essentially is one little card and, and, and it's over. It it's, it's, it's done. Oh yes, boys. All we need is one card and it's over. Not the card I was hoping for, looking for, dreaming about. But, uh, should have probably played Chandra and just light up the stage. But, then again... Wait, do I just thin street dodger? Ah, I can't, I can't... No, game! Ah, oh, god damn it. Well, it's fine. You know, wait, could have I done that? Not sure. Probably not. Anyway, this is fine. This, 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 this is 100% on the fine list. Okay, so let me think about this for a second. Two innkeepers... The th this thing that no one ever in their life plays, Allegiance and... Yeah. This is probably one of the o Well, this is one of the only four decks that is currently being played in this five-player capped game, but still. V very intriguing that we managed to queue into it. You know? 
I'm sure a lot of people will say, that's that that's just normal RNG right there. Uh, but yeah, for some reason I, I, I tend to think differently, you know? For some reason I do tend to think a little bit differently. But admittedly, again, all we need to do is, Jesus Christ, more legions ends? Okay, but again, all we need to do is literally at this situation, just a singular, bingular, what's it called? The thing, the, the, the enchantment enemy couldn't got rid of this thing. If we do that, and I believe we can because heart of the cards and whatnot. That's not heart of the cards, huh? Okay, that's that that's just absolutely peachy. Okay, let's attack with a spit roast and see what happens. And then we use this thing, my minus two, it's amazing. You do you do the stage lighting and it's effective, and yes, you can for some reason use it like that. Don't ask me why. And there we have it, boys! <laughs> Wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, maybe we don't actually win. No, we can always top deck something. Okay, the game... Like, look at this. The game is literally... The game literally just did everything. Everything to make this guy win. And he was so close to defeat. If the game literally did not give him every single perfect top deck and everything, he would have lost. <laughs> this is how powerful this deck is, boys. And let's be real, it's, it's a red deck, so it is really powerful. But yeah. Six, six minutes, fifty seconds. I already want to off myself and now want to see what's the, what tomorrow holds, not gonna lie. Okay, so let's start off with this and this. No one cares. Just, 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 just face. Boom. Okay, I wonder if the game's gonna try and stop me now. Because nobody's gonna stop me now. They're having a good time. Uh, don't wanna stop at all. Okay, I think this is the play. I think this is definitely the play. So he has a bunch of colors, and at least one of these colors in, in, involves uh, elimination of thingamajigs. Oh god, it's a ram deck. Oh, that's a little bit a lot unlucky, enemy kun. Oh no, so sad. Much, much, much sadness. Well, I need to play this in case he has a wipe somewhere, in, uh, somewhere along the lines. If he has, we don't care. Because, you know, Cavalier of Calamity and, you know, just the Scorch Spitter. Ah, oh, good times. Not really. Look at this. He's actually warming a cup of something. That's such a good pet. He looks fucking disgusting. But, you know, such a good pet. Oh, no. Wait. Oh, because he can double it up. Now I understand, enemy con. But that creates two big boys, and this is a calamity, and that's a scorch spitter. In the moment, I ge essentially, you you see what's going on, you understand what's happening. This guy probably does not fully understand what's happening, uh, but he's pretty close to that that part where he just flat out loses. You know, when the bone crusher is your best play. Ah, oh, he's gonna get two lands. Okay, are we actually playing against people who are gonna somehow miraculously survive the onslaught of a red deck? I honestly didn't think that they can come. But, wait, he had no, he has red. Oh my god, look at that, a questing beast. I can't- oh, he just surrendered. <clears throat> okay, good. At least he did not top deck everything in life. Well, he actually did not top deck probably a single thing that he wanted. Ah, magic. A fickle mistress. A thick mistress. Definitely searching magic hentai after this video. But, anyway, moving onward. And also, while I haven't forgotten, we have a new Patreon. Debt by Jazz. Is that a meme, by the way? Because I have seen in my Discord the meme about jazz, and you know it's 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 questionable. So let's see what do we have here. Stuff and MacGuffins seems perfect. Okay, as long as we get a two-cost thingy, and you know more stuff. Do I want to start with this? Now I want to start with this for the perfect split roast. 
Well. Enemy. Oh, God. Oh, 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 oh. Is this gonna be a... A red deck versus red deck? That would be pretty amazingly sad. <laughs> okay. So, let's see. Oh, no, it's not against the red deck. But it's already a late game, because it's a red deck. Well, I'm a red deck. Don't look at my stuff. No, seriously, well, what are you gonna do with my stuff? Oh, God, the lava coil. So much pizzazz, so much shablayas. That's absolutely amazing. I'm not gonna drop the sp uh, spitros just yet, because I want to start dealing some aggressive moves, as the kids say, against his face. So he starts to panic. Because again, we're in the late game. At least for me. Oh god, he didn't do anything, huh? Okay, so this is how we're gonna do it. We're dro gonna drop a knight, dude. And now we're gonna attack with everything. He needs to slowly start to understand that, you know, his life points are a virtue. Okay. He d didn't do anything, and now he concedes, because Chandra split roast time. Also, he has three mana. If he only uses that mana to remove this, well, we can just drop a thin street boy, and well, it's essentially GG. <gasps> what is that? It's something with mutate, but does that matter? No, it does not. It does not matter, boys, at all. Activate ability, pump up that gobble with some steroids. Pump up that gobble and observe how much damage Chandra's stuff does. Okay, okay, and he surrenders. <clears throat> what a deck, boys. What a deck. Ever wanted to play competitive magic? This is your start. I have absolutely no doubt that some of you may just get into a tournament just by playing a random red diagro deck. Literally not a single doubt in my mind. Oh, a 40 avatar. Is it time for life gain decks magic? I hope not. This deck is not good against life gain. Well, you know, it's it's still a thing. Also, we still have the Chandra split rose there. We have a Naxos with the good skin. It's it's fine. It's it's cool. Not really, but hey, at least it's something. Okay, attack. I'm already ahead. Play a pl play a shock land. Oh god, that's not a shock land. Wait a minute, that's a vampire waifu. Oh god, what am I supposed to do now? Well, we, we killed the vampire waifu. Honestly, pretty simplistic stuff. Well, enemy con- are you gonna block? No, you're not gonna block, obviously. Okay, that was partially what I wanted to get. He's looking at the hand. He's he's thinking about things. Contemplation. Oh god, a duo color deck. His chances just grow slimmer and slimmer by the millisecond, a nanosecond even. Oof. Hey, what? What? <laughs> Hello. Haven't seen that in a while. Also, probably for goddamn good reasons. Okay, now we're gonna drop the Chandra and create fire elementals, because that's damage. Boom, 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 I want you in my room. Okay, so how are we gonna do this? Well, the plan's simple. Get two lands, get the enchantment, get a spit roast online. <gasps> Did you just pay a life? Uh-oh. Wait a minute. That is not great. That has death touch and life link. I I I, I feel some problems. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, that's bad. That's actually bad. Okay, what am I supposed to do now? I am not the smartest person in life, so I don't exactly understand these situations. I'm a red deck, but I can't go all face because dead touch life link porcupines for some reason exist. And that just happened. Wait, did I just deal damage to him somehow? Wait, I did deal damage to him somehow. How? I should really read what cards do. Wow, that, that's, that's amazing. Okay, 
So what's going to happen? Here is hopefully not much. He can continue to remove my things. Wait a minute, that's sacrifice a planeswalker. That was my Chandra! Okay, this is a lot problematic. Okay, we got a thing. And now we did, did the stuff. 10th Street Dodger. Everyone knows he will not be able to avoid killing the 10th Street Dodger. All I need is one enchantment up, up here and we're gonna be absolutely fine. 10 out of 10 could not be more fine. Don't look at my Chandra. Oh, because it has Death Touch and Lifelink! Oh, that's so unlucky to queue in this. Huh. Seriously, is it rigged against Thread Decks also now? I can't win against that. Okay, so yeah, it seems it's rigged against Thread Decks. Uh, so, red, uh, this is why I'm not seeing a lot of Thread Decks, because they're just made to lose now? Because people run crap like that? Oof, I, uh, I don't know, hard, hard to imagine that that would be the case. The majority players are Red Deck players, so how is this even possible? Have we ever done a video of a Red Deck? Okay. If I keep this hand, how will the game fix it? God, having to mulligan a hand, a, a, you know, a, a hand like this. Pretty, pretty, pretty inconceivable, not gonna lie. Okay, what is that? An evolving wilds with a cool looking art. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Also, notice the clear discrepancy between these edges and these edges when you click them. It, it, it's, it's a nice choice in my opinion. It's 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 a fine choice. Okay, do this and see what happens. It's it's wait, is that a red deck? <gasps> oh god, it actually could be a red. Why are you looking at my grim initiate? He only wants to get initiated, and you're looking at him funny. Well, it's a boss avatar, so technically, not much of value will be lost if he just loses. Okay, so do this attack. Also, what's the deal? I am not getting one. Oh wait, wait! Here, here it is. Don't relax, boys. Relax. I was gonna say, what's what's happening? I'm not getting Kalir of Calamity. Wait, what? Oh God, you're using removal against me? That is so not cools. So so not coolio, brolio. But, on the other hand, that's a Chandra Spirit Roast right there, and this is still damage to the face on a very active, proactive stage. Woo! Okay, think he has more AoE wipes? I think he does. But again, Chandra Split Roasts don't care. Oh yes, they definitely do not give two shits. Uh... A Kiora? Uh-oh, that's bad. So... The old age rule of two still stands. We cannot attack Kiara, our waifu. Yes. It is impossible to us to break this golden rule of existence. If we ever attack Kiara or hurt Kiara or fail to mind control her and get her on our side and protect her, we will delete magic. Because that is unacceptable. And that's pitiful. Not gonna lie, enemy con. That's that. That's pretty petty. Okay. Wait. Wait a minute. I don't have the mana to cast that. What the hell, game? Okay. Well, anyway, you're you're almost dead. So technically, I don't think it exactly matters a lot. Boom, boom. Ah, uh, keep rocking those split roasts. What a deck. Don't block. You're just you're just delaying the inevitable. Oh, enemy con. I feel so sorry for you because I have a Trollbjorn in hand. Honestly, I should use four Trollbjorns in this deck, but... You know, there's always a but, right? Also, what the hell is that? Is that a Draco set? It's a Draco set. You know what the, the, You know what that Draco set does? Absolutely nothing, because suddenly a Shablam, a Magic Papau, and he's just dead from three Calamity Strikes. Well, actually, two Calamity Strikes. Yes! Magic, what a game. Am I right or am I almost 100%? Can I please stop the recording? If I, if I, if I stop here, my boss will kill me.
He, he barely feeds me bread. And he will absolutely destroy me if I stop playing right here. He said, videos are 25 minutes, no more, no less. And I usually fuck up and make them a little bit more. But you know, still. Okay. So, what am I supposed to do? I'm stuck between a rock and a hard place. And I don't exactly know how that can even happen. Okay. Maybe it was... Nah, let's just do this and see what happens. BAM! Perfection. PERFECTION, BOYS! Okay, this is literally the, the hand of the gods. If he has removal, he is gonna use it against these things. Because trust me when I say this, no one wants to deal with the goddamn spit uh, scorcher. Okay, enemy could. Wait, what? What? What's that? What? 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 Okay, so we have won, like, at least 50 games and lost, like, I don't know, a game or minus game? I don't know, not, not sure. Ooh, good card. Let's open a pack to get my mind off of this. Oh, Tero's Beyond Death pack. Amazing. It's nothing, like always. An Ikoria, the Lair of the Behemoth. And it's a... Ugly, but all, uh, uh, ugly, what's, it, what's this thing called again? Uh, let me think. This, this has a dinosaur? No, it's not. Hippo! That's right, it's a hippo. An ugly hippo with a tail. Well, hi hippos do actually have tails, but they're, they're, they're not giant, you know, like, uh, triceratops tails. Or whatever the hell the dinosaur was called that has the triangular, four angular shapes on its body. Oh. Why not? Keeping this bad boy of a hand open, straight open, and why not? Okay, so, this is the play- wait, what is this? An U Umori, the collector. No one cares. I go- I get to go first, so it's absolutely fine. Okay. So here's the plan. Go face. I- I know, it, it's a deep- even if some may say existential plan, you know, go face, see what happens, see what what is, you know, all dead jazz. But we're doing it. Think he can actually wipe out things. I think this is gonna turn out uh, turn to be one of those uh, waiting games where I just have to actually wait and see what happens. Ooh la la! Look at that, boys. Well, now I drop this. And I attack with everything. Don't care if the tinny boy gets killed. He probably won't because, again, it's this. It, 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 he needs to drop one more land. He can drop this and then. Ooh, scary stuff starts to happen. Did he just mutate that? Yes, he did. Am I playing against a mutate deck? Yes, I am. Maybe. Who knows at this point? Okay, so anyway. Uh, he thought that he can survive a little bit longer, but it's really questionable because if we look at his HP and all the resources available to me, uh, it doesn't look like he has a lot. Yep, and there he explodes. Oh, boys, my neurons, they're shooting everywhere currently. I have never felt this smart in my life. It's, it's, it's an absolute overload of stuff. Okay, let's actually see if we can buy any daily deals. I think there's still ones that I want. Oh, I, lo I want the Lyra. I want the Nexus. <coughs> I want the Phoenix. I want the Tyrant. Got already the Fifari and the Settledine Wreckage. Okay. So, oh. Just, just a minute for me to explain this. Not bags, but store. This is goddamn genius, because, you see, no one wants to pay actual real-life gold money. Well, real-life gold is still a thing. Uh, gold for cosmetics that look like horrible abominations uh, of humanity's greatest achievements. So, what they did is they implemented a store, and you can buy random MacGuffins, 
And the only reason why this exists is, if you really, really want something and you don't have the gold, you can spend the gems. But the people who have the gold will spend the gold. A.K.A. Previously, I could save up like a hundred, almost a hundred k every season until the next, uh, until the next, until the next uh, expansion set roll, rolls around, right? Now, because of this, I I don't have gold. But you know what I do have? I have three playable draft entries and two sealed entries, which I will absolutely never use because I hate those things. I think they're stupid. And I dislike them severely. Even more than playing red decks, even. Just if anyone was actually wondering. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, is this an Agent of Treachery deck? Can I please play against an Agent of Treachery deck? It's gonna be so good. Let me do it. Let me do it. These avatars only play one kind of deck, and it's an Agent of Treachery deck. Let me do it. Also, stop clicking your goat or whatever the hell that is. Ah, uh, Calamity, Grim Initiated, a little bit of Annexes. This seems okay-ish. This definitely seems okay-ish. Okay, what are we gonna do? Well, one thing we're gonna do is we're gonna use, use a womanly scrub to scrub our feet when I, when I go wash today. Because they need a scrubbing. I can feel a little bit of rough skin on my, on my, whatever the hell, the part of the leg, the foot, the feet, the sole. <sighs> yeah, I told you it's either a mind control deck or a red deck. It's never anything else with these people. Okay, great stuff. So how does first strike versus first strike interact? Oh no. <laughs> I don't think it also matters. Wow! Ooh, ah! Ooh, that, that hurt! Oh! Uh, do you have light up the stage? Because it looks like you have light up the stage. Also, you have only three cards in your hand, which puts you in a severe disadvantage against my own stupidity. Ooh, ha, ha, ha. Okay. So, what's happening now? Okay, hello? What's happening? You to go? Hello? Enemy could? Did, did your brain also overload with the options? Because my will. That's for sure. Okay, so... Do something! Do it! Palpatine voice, do it! Come on, you're playing a, a red deck. UNLIMITED POWER! Or something like that. That was probably the worst Palpatine ever. But I can do whatever the hell that, that frog thing was. MISA! I think that's pretty accurate. I think that's pretty good. Star Wars hired me. We all know that he's the true Sith Lord. And he planned everything. Oh, Jar Jar Binks. How could I have ever forgotten? Well, that's the average amount of time a red deck needs to figure out what's his next move. But boom! A calamity of sorts. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, what's my next turn? I actually needed to light up the stage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Humbug. By the way, why can't I pick who gets the buff? Everyone else can- Oh, hello there. What's your name? What's your size? What's your number? This gives me so much advantage. It's sickening. If he doesn't kill it, obviously. I don't think he will. I think he's gonna play Embercleave. Hmm. Uh, let's just play him no matter what. He's gonna block with his own Chandra because that's just the way, uh, way, aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, I like it. 
You know, he doesn't have another option. It's 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 death by Snoo Snoo or the split roast on split roast action, which is ex pretty much almost the same thing. Wait, what? No. Does does he also have a calamity? <gasps> Ah! Wait! Oh no, I died because I can't block everything. Ah! Damn it, we even got into the late game. How anticlimactic uh, anti is that? Well, that just happened, somehow. Oh, uh, yeah, didn't expect to exactly see that, but I guess the best best man won. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Who ex who expects to see... Like, people play red decks, but people don't play uh, the Calamity red decks. I don't know why, it's still overpowered, it's all held, but, you know, whatever. So, anyway, this is the deck. This was Kudur Sensen. Thanks for watching, subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel, check out Discord, check out the everything and oh patreon right patreon and have a nice day bye bye